in their 52 years of business in Des Moines. Nothing's like this has happened, so pretty crazy. It was a routine Tuesday morning for Eric and Tanya Frangos, co-owners of Jim's Coney Island. We opened at 10 o'clock and we had one customer at about 10:15. But a mere 15 minutes later, we just heard a big crack. We were in the back and um, didn't really know what had happened. That big crack turned out to be the sound of a bullet coming straight through the building. One customer was nearly hit. Too close for comfort, you know, but uh, yeah, fortunately nothing uh, happened, so. Just about 10 minutes after that initial call for shots fired, Des Moines police apprehended two suspects and residents that live nearby who witnessed the shooting were able to help police identify an involved vehicle, which they now say was stolen. Two suspects, both juveniles, have been charged with theft and interference with official acts. I guess there was some uh, action outside that some juveniles were shooting at each other and it was a stray bullet that happened in here. And despite the damage to their space, the local business owners are just thankful that no one was hurt. It all happened really fast and it was short and uh, it was just, uh, just kind of blows you away a little bit that happens right here. Megan McPherson, Local 5 News. The business was able to reopen today after being closed for a part of the day yesterday. Des Moines Police told Local 5 that there are no new details to share tonight. They are still investigating.